Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here, another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to resolve if you're getting an error on Mozilla Firefox, the XUL runner error that says that the platform version is not compatible. So generally this will mean that there is an issue with the installation of Firefox. So I would suggest actually uninstalling and reinstalling the Firefox application and that should hopefully be able to address the problem and resolve it. So we're going to start by opening up the start menu, just off on the start button one time. Type in uninstall. Best match should come back with add or remove programs, or it should be one of the best matches. Just want to left on that one time. If you're on Windows 7 or Windows 8, you can just type in uninstall or go into the control panel and then add or remove programs. So it might look a little different on Windows 10. So you want to go and locate the Mozilla Firefox application here, left on at one time. And then left click on uninstall. Should see this app and its related info will be uninstalled. Left click on uninstall. If you receive a user account control prompt, you want to left click on yes. Welcome to the Mozilla Firefox uninstall wizard. Left click on next. Left click on uninstall. and then left click on finish. So at this point restart your computer and I will be right back. Okay guys once you've restarted your computer you want to go ahead and open up a web browser here. I'm going to open up Google Chrome for this tutorial however it doesn't really matter if you want to use Microsoft Edge or Internet Explorer. Again it doesn't really matter but we're going to go ahead and open up a web browser here because we are going to go ahead and reinstall the Firefox web browser. Once your browser is fully loaded, we're going to head over to google.com. And into Google, we're going to type in Mozilla Firefox. And we enter. One of the best matches should be for download Firefox free web browser. It should have a mozilla.org in the domain name of the website. Just want to left click on that one time. Now you want to select download now. You don't actually have to enter an email or anything. It should automatically begin downloading the installer. And once the installer is finished downloading to your computer, just want to left click on it one time to open up the actual installer file. If you receive a security notification from the Mozilla Corporation, you want to left click on yes or user account control prompt. Again, just want to left click on yes, run. You want to go make sure that restore default settings to remove old add-ons for optimal performance is checkmarked and then left click on reinstall.
then once it has been reinstalled, you can go ahead and change your home page, reinstall your favorite add-ons, whatever you want to do. So pretty straightforward tutorial today, guys. I do hope I was able to help you out. And I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.